Talented footballers in Singapore as young as 12 will soon be able to move between academies or clubs with a price. And this is among new youth development initiatives that the Football Association of Singapore wants to roll out in 2024. Aslam Shah with the story. Talent drain is a common woe among local youth football academies. Their best players often leave when bigger clubs come calling. We always build players and at a certain point in time, we understand that they have to go. They have to go. Reason being is because our resources are not as big as other academies or clubs. So it's fair enough for them to leave and expand their wings. Now, under new plans by the FAS, these academies will be financially compensated when their players leave for greener pastures or when they turn pro. But these academies must first be certified through FAS's new accreditation system. This database allows them to monitor player development and identify talents early. And when the talent turns pro, the new employers must pay all the academies that contributed to the player's development so far. It is a game changer in terms of giving support and recognition to the very people who deserve our support and recognition. The people who actually encourage kids to play, develop them and then move them on to different tiers as they progress in their journey to become better and better footballers. The money must be used by the academies to develop more youth talents. FES is still in talks with local academies and clubs on the exact amount of compensation and how the disbursements will work. It has spoken to about 25 out of 40 established academies so far and many are on board. If let's say you are talking about the compensation coming from, a, from the federation itself, then I think that is much more viable. Other initiatives include a new youth league and a new volunteer program.